The Sooners back inside the Everest Indoor Training Center for spring practice number two. Today we focus on the linebackers. Tim Kish entering his second season coaching the linebackers for OU and with that comes more familiarity and higher expectations. There's a lot of energy out here. I think the enthusiasm is great. You know, there's some things that we got to work on still fundamentally and technique wise, which is always going to be the case. Um, but I like the way we're co you know, our competitive spirit and uh, just got to keep making sure that we're improving each day. It's going pretty good. Um, everyone's flying around. Everyone's running around, being physical, and uh, everyone's amped and excited about this spring. Well, this year has been way better because last year it was my first time playing Mike. But this year, since I got that playing time last year, it's helped me out like to understand the calls better, understand like the different keys and what I need to read on the field. Specifically with the linebackers, what are you trying to accomplish this spring? Uh, I want. Uh, it, it's really great competition. I only have six of them, but uh, you know the competition's great at each position. I moved a couple people around. Uh, you know, everybody's going to have to earn their playing time, and that's uh, the way you want it. So I'm excited uh, because this group is really uh, uh, working hard right now, and uh, we got a long way to go to be a finished product, but that's the beauty of spring practice, and I just like the attitude that everybody has right now. Uh, Coach Kish just told us that we have to be uh, the leaders of the group, and that's what we're trying to accomplish. We're trying to go out there and show people that we can lead, show them that we can play, and show them that uh, – the linebackers are what, what holds the defense together. Uh, we just got to um, come together as one and be the leaders on the field. That's what Coach Kids tell us every day. Just, we got to be the leaders because we, we, we got a small group this year. We only got six of us right now, and then we got two coming in. But we just got to be able to go out there and lead and um, uh, get, gain everyone's tr trust on the field. How much of an advantage is it for these guys that there is just six of them and they're all getting lots of reps and lots of time with you? Well, that's what they like. You know, I mean, it's uh, I can specialize, you know, and individualize a little bit with each guy because everybody needs a little something different. But uh, they are getting plenty of reps and no one's complaining about that. So uh, I think it's a good situation for everybody. We're able to get way more reps than we were um, last year. And... The more risk we get, we're able to um, learn more on the field. Uh, this is probably the, the closest linebacker group um, that I've been a part of. It seems like each year it gets closer and closer, and uh, this is probably the, the closest group that I've been a part of. The Sooners will be back on the practice field on Tuesday, where we'll take a closer look at the offensive line and new O-line coach Bill Biedenboe. Be sure to keep it right here on Soonersports.com for all of your spring football coverage.